what is refresh rate, response time, and ELMB. Marami nagtatanong sa akin about refresh rate and response time. So, sasagutin natin yan as simple as I can para maintindihan ng lahat. Fortunately, Asus sent us this tough gaming VG249Q1A which is 24 inch and has a refresh rate of 165 hertz. 1 millisecond response time, IPS display, 1080p resolution, has ELMB and FreeSync compatible. Simulan natin sa refresh rate. Usually, nakatay up ang refresh rate sa frames per second or commonly known as FPS. So para maka-benefit ka sa 165Hz na monitor, kailangan mo ng hardware like graphics card and processor na kaya ang 165FPS. Kasi yung monitor nagre-refresh din yan every time na mag-change ng frame or yung picture sa screen mo. Example, from one picture papunta sa next picture. Dalawang frames yan. Imagine, yung hardware mo is kaya yung 165FPS pero yung monitor mo is only 60Hz. So sa monitor, kailangan niyang pagkasahin yung 165 frames per second sa 60 hertz. So in reality, 60 fps lang yung nakikita mo sa monitor. Yan din yung dahilan kung bakit nagkaka-screen tearing. Next is response time. Response time naman refers sa speed ng monitor mo mag-respond ng certain action. Example, nag-move ka ng mouse mo papunta sa left. It will take a fraction of a millisecond para i-process ng processor and another fraction of a millisecond para ma-project sa monitor. In our case, one millisecond yung response time. Now, let's go with ELMB or Extreme Low Motion Blur. This is a technology from ASUS to reduce motion blur. In most cases, meron talagang motion blur, kagaya nitong UFO tracking. Yung function ni ELMB is to make this motion blur minimal as much as possible by strobing backlight. Sa practical use, lalo na sa gaming, in some cases na in-effect yung motion blur, headshot na sana, kaso after image lang pala yun. Or feeling mo lang magaling ka, yun pala. Hindi, pasangin lang pag yung monitor. Banga! Banga! Agyan! Mura mag ako. <laughs> I hope naintindihan nyo. If meron kayong mga tanong, comment lang sa comment section. Thank you for watching. Bye!